हेलो स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट दी फिजियोलॉजिकल एसिड बेस बैलेंस राइट सो आज वी नो दैट एसिड बेस इज समथिंग विच इज विच विल बी देयर इन टू दी आवर ब्लड एंड इट विल बी कीप ऑन बैलेंसिंग बिकॉज द नॉर्मल पी एच ऑफ द ब्लड विच इज सेवन पॉइंट फोर जीरो दैट हैज टू बी मेंटेन फ्रीक्वेंटली एट ईच एंड एवरी कॉर्नर ऑफ द बॉडी सो हाउ द पर्टिकुलर ह्यूमन बॉडी इट इज गोइंग टू एडॉप्ट द फिजियोलॉजिकल एसिड बेस बैलेंस राइट सो देर आर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ रिएक्शन इट इज गोइंग टू टेकन प्लेस राइट सो द ह्यूमन बॉडी अंडर गो वेरियस फिजियोलॉजिकल फंक्शंस वॉट फॉर टू मेंटेन एसिड बेस बैलेंस राइट सो वेरियस टाइप्स ऑफ फिजियोलॉजिकल फंक्शन इट इज गोइंग टू एडॉप्ट और इट इट अंडर गो राइट टू जस्ट टू बिकॉज ऑफ द बैलेंसिंग ऑफ दिस एसिड बेस बिकॉज टू मच एसिडिक इट इज ऑल्सो are dangerous and too much basic is also it is dangerous so it has to be neutral ph has to be maintained by the uh, biological fluid or bi body fluid okay so the ph of the human body range between 7.35 to 7.45 with the average ph it uh, 7.40 so this average ph this uh, that, that has to be maintained by the blood or other uh biological uh, uh, human body fluid okay so what is the condition what are the uh, factors uh, which can cause the imbalance right actually uh, why we ha why the body has to go for the physiological acid base balance so the factor causes acid base imbalance right why it is going to disturb the balance of this particular ph why uh, it is not going to maintain uh, in the different circumstances right so there are two types of condition acidosis and uh, alkalosis right so here as the name indicate acidosis means low plasma ph or low blood ph though the this blood ph will go to the 6 uh, uh 5 4 like that okay so in which condition it is going to have the low ph or it is going to have the acidosis more production of carbon dioxide more production of organic acids high intake of acidic products uh, right it may be uh, any kind of food or it may be any kinds of drug right and uh, sometimes the failure in the metabolic acid excretion right so metabolic acid which is going to form during the digestion that uh, if if it is not able to excrete from the body in that condition the body comes under the acidosis and the plasma ph it is going to decrease another side uh, the another condition or another cause we can say that is called the alkalosis right it is nothing but high plasma ph okay when uh, the plasma ph it will increase uh, uh, then this average one uh, maybe 8 9 10 or something like that right so what is the condition what are the reason uh, behind that so low production of carbon dioxide just opposite of this here more production of carbon dioxide here low production of carbon dioxide hydrogen ion right high production of uh, hco3 hydronium right uh, that is the bicarbonate uh, uh, it is going to uh, ion ion production it is going to be high and the alkaline drug consumption when the any drug it is basic in nature and if it will be consumed frequently by the particular patient it can undergo for the alkalosis so these are the reasons where the acid base become imbalanced right now what body does uh, for uh, this particular uh, maintenance of this particular uh, imbalance uh, condition right so there are uh, uh, some uh, different types of function which we are going to maintain like right? maintenance of acid base balance right so the first one buffer system so under buffer system uh, there are three types of buffer system body maintain carbonic acid and bicarbonate buffer system phosphate buffer system and protein buffer system then another right uh, the another side uh, uh, elimination of ions by kidney by that also it acid base balance can be maintained and through the respiratory system right so let us discuss these three buffer system basically this you need to write in this particular question right so the coming to the first one that is called acid uh, carbonic acid uh, and the bicarbonate uh, buffer system right so when we talk about the carbonic acid and bicarbonate buffer system this we need to understand properly the first one uh, that is the carbonic acid and bicarbonate buffer system okay so here carbon dioxide which will produced by uh, respiratory right so in the into, into the body uh, after having the particular cellular respiration this carbon dioxide will react uh, with the water presence into the uh, biological fluid or uh, in the body fluid right and it will convert into the carbonic acid h2co3 right h2co3 okay then uh, 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 with the presence of uh, hydrogen ion uh, by by the releasing of hydrogen ion 
it become bicarbonate ion HCO3 right so here H2 it was there one hydrogen released the HCO3 right so uh, whenever it will get uh, any sodium ion and uh, it becomes uh, again HCO3 uh, with the, uh, this HCO3 uh, uh, by reacting with the sodium ion uh, it is going to convert into the sodium bicarbonate NaHCO3 sodium bicarbonate right so yeah, that's what you can see here I have given the reversible uh, arrow mark right so it this is the entire system which is known as a uh, carbonic acid and bicarbonate buffer system so here you can see carbonic acid H2CO3 and here uh, bicarbonate ion HCO3 right so it is interchanging it may happen uh, depend on the condition where uh, which one is excess like carbonic acid it is excess so then again it is going to uh, release the one hydrogen ion and it become bicarbonate ion right bicarbonate ion again it can uh, react with the uh, sodium and it can become uh, sodium bicarbonate sodium bicarbonate again releasing of the hydrogen ion it become bicarbonate and then carbonic acid so on so like that they will be doing interchanging this thing happen in the lung plasma and uh, different tissues right the second important uh, in the uh, acid base balance phosphate buffer system right so when we talk about the phosphate buffer system uh, we'll be having here uh, uh, whenever the hydrogen ion it will be excess it will be having uh, disodium uh, phosphate uh, Na2HPO4 right so here uh, two sodium molecule that's a disodium phosphate okay it will uh, convert into the uh, monosodium phosphate NaH2PO4 plus sodium ion is going to release so this is the system is known as phosphate buffer system so here uh, this Na2HPO4 is to NaH2PO4 right so thus just these two it is going uh, this side and that side so this thing uh, it will be in the different ratio for example 4 is to 1 it will be in the plasma whereas and uh, 1 is to 9 it will be there in the urine right so this ratio it will be maintained depend on the requirement of where it is supposed to have and how they are going to balance right so like that reaction it go on in the phosphate buffer system then uh, next one it is the uh, this will be there in the kidney right so remember that's what in urine also kidney and the different cells like blood cells and all those things right coming to the third one that is called the uh, protein buffer system right so when we call our proteins are nothing but uh, in this uh, different proteins will be having amino group and the acid groups right so here is one example here uh, you can see here uh, it, it is this particular uh, protein uh, like for example here amino group will be there h2 n then c r any functional group h then c o o h right c o o plus h hydrogen it is raising the hydrogen ion and uh, uh, uh when uh, it is reacting with the hydrogen ion and this hydrogen ion it is going to attach and it become acid group right and uh, uh, further here it is going to accept the hydrogen ion so here two things it may happen it in one side it may be releasing and in another side it may be accepting the hydrogen ion depends on the situation so this protein buffer system will be there into the uh, it can be seen into the cells and the plasma so like that body will maintain their different types of uh, buffer system uh, in different types of uh, uh, acid base balance depend on to the requirement and the, that's what you can see into the location it is happening the carbonic acid and bicarbonate buffer system you may see into the lung plasma and tissue whereas phosphate buffer system will be there in the kidney and other cells and the protein buffer system will be there in cells and the plasma so like that by interchanging of the different ions uh, they are going to manage uh, wherever the acidity is increased uh, more acid so they will become uh, uh, they will uh, try to get it uh, to the neutral like 7.40 this average on an average pH has to be maintained by the body at different locations so that body will be there in the healthy condition otherwise it will be problems thank you